handle this. A heinous crime in Kenner brings with it a back and forth over undocumented immigration. Paul Murphy reports the police chief says it's a sign of a larger problem, but others say it's just rhetoric. Kenner police have arrested 23 year old Diego Rodriguez Salvador. He's accused of kidnapping a 13 year old girl from the Veterans Heights subdivision on Tuesday night and raping her. Police say Rodriguez was a friend of the family who offered to drive the girl to a store. On the way to the store, she noticed he was going in a different direction. He pulled a knife out, took her to a trailer that he lived in on Melinda Court, and he sexually assaulted her. Police Chief Keith Conley confirms Rodriguez is undocumented and in the country illegally. The same undocumented illegals that are coming through Eagle Pass that have been a thorn in Texas aside, they're just moving further in. And I think we're all seeing that now. And it's, it's everything from small violations to big violations. It's just a drain on resources. We don't condone any kind of behavior that it can be detrimental for our community. But Hispanic community advocate Tatiana Bigolt says focusing on the suspect's legal status is not relevant to the crime he's accused of committing. And she claims such rhetoric stokes fear in the community. And if we fall under that rhetoric, then every uh, American is this, every immigrant is that, or every individual, we're all humans. There is good and bad in every nationality. More than one in four Kenner residents identify as Hispanic. Chief Connolly says his department does not focus on ethnicity, it focuses on crime. If you're here uh, undocumented or illegally and you don't do anything wrong, we wouldn't know. We would have no reason to be concerned with what you do. Uh, the, the issue is every time we turn around, we are having issues. Rodriguez was booked on charges of second degree kidnapping and second degree rape of the juvenile. Paul Murphy, WWL, Louisiana. Chief Connolly didn't provide any statistics about how many undocumented immigrants are committing crimes in Kenner. It'll be up to federal authorities to charge the suspect with being in the country illegally.